All right, guys, here's a turbo that uh, came out of the same, same engine that I'm rebuilding it out of the 2012 Audi A4 Quattro turbo, of course. Um, and if you see this release gate, apparently this is supposed to be tight, that way it doesn't have any movement whatsoever. As you see in this one, it does move, so you just slide with the finger. There's a few probably videos up there, I'm sure someone already posted how to uh, fix this thing. Uh, they have a repair shops that they actually cut that out right there and take it out and force another sleeve in there. There is a sleeve that goes from here down, like a hinge, you know, then, then this rod goes through it. So, uh, um, what I'm gonna attempt to do is, uh, I'm gonna already remove the pin. There's a little locking washer that goes on the bottom right here. So I took the washer out. It looks just like this, one of those lock washers. That way the uh, pin doesn't come out. So all you do is just uh, pry a screwdriver under it and get it out. So it's relatively easy. And then, sorry about that. And then this should pop right out. I'm doing it to one hand. There you go. See now how it pop right out. I'll just put that on the side. But don't force too much on it because you don't want to bend this rod. It's going all the way back in there. Now you can see, you can move this with the finger. See the whole thing kind of moves, see this? You shouldn't be doing this. Uh, there's supposed to be tight snug in here that way it doesn't give it this room. And then at the same time down on the bottom. So what I'm gonna uh, do is basically we'll pull the top end this way and the bottom end that way. But not too much though, and just to be slightly. You can even use the two wrenches. So one wrench there, and another one down here. And kind of pull the twist just a little bit. If you do too much, then you might have an overboost. So you don't want that. So I'm going to attempt to do that now. I'll put the uh, uh, this camera on a stand in a sec. Okay, as you see, uh, I took the... Uh, piece of rag and put under the wrench here that way it doesn't sc scrape or damage the uh, this little access door so this is kind of a dangerous way to do it too guys because you don't want to bend this right here then it stays crooked they won't shut the hole completely so when you do this you have to be real patient and do real real carefully uh, if you see this has a little bit movement in there so this is uh, almost better than be topping with a hammer then I take out the wrench and I will put them here, making sure it's right in the center. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just kind of pull them this way together. I think I did a little bit. So now, what I do, you pull a little bit and then we'll close it back up and we'll put this in there. As you see, it sits now really nice and tight, no movement. Mine was messed up here too, a little bit, but I was able to fix it back. So that's how you fix Turbo Temporary, which one was under boosting. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.